I'm Steve Johnson, the owner of Grand Illusions. Today I'm going to teach you my floating finger ring routine, The Pull of Love, that was originally published in Floating Freely in a Fine Fashion, a book I wrote back in 1992. You can either use your own finger ring, or you can borrow a finger ring. For this first routine, we're going to use our own. I've got my wedding band, and I've got my GTR pinned on in the usual location on my undershirt. Just so you guys can see a little clearer, I'll take the overshirt off that would normally conceal my GTR from the public. I'm going to take my little wax ball here, there we go. So I've got my thread line on my wax ball. I'm going to take off my ring and thread the line through the center of the ring. There we go. And stick that wax ball to the wall off to my right. So now the ring is threaded right here on the line. But I'm not going to show the audience that yet. I would have done this all before I started the trick and put my ring right back on my hand. Now, you'd be surprised. The thread can run freely in between my finger and the ring, despite the fact that this ring is fairly snug on my hand. And the ITK6 thread is pretty strong stuff. So, I've got my thread going right through my ring, and I'm ready to do my trick. Bring up my hand, pull off my ring, the thread's right to the middle of it, set it on my right hand, and using my left thumb to lift the thread closest to me, the ring stands up. By moving my right hand out from underneath of it, the ring floats. Our usual move to prove there's no strings, wave under, wave over. Nobody ever thinks of a horizontal system. If I lift up this end, the ring flies away from me. And if I lower this end and press the thread down against my finger with my thumb, the ring will fly back onto my finger, where I can push it back snug. Typically in this routine, I will break my thread to get back out of it. But you don't have to. If you've anchored to your coffee cup, like I do on your instructional DVD, you could just reach over, pick up your cup, and you'd have your thread line back in your hands. If you're under some pressure and you need to get away from your audience, just break that thread, reset your GTR later when no one's looking. That's the pull of love. Now we're going to learn pull of love using a borrowed finger ring, only slightly more difficult than using our own. This time, I've got my GTR pin in its normal location, and I would normally have a shirt over the top of that, but for the sake of this video, I'm going to let you see where it is. I've got my wax ball underneath of my thumbnail, and my thread line is running right here. I'm going to borrow the ring from the spectator and place it on my own ring finger, on the same hand that has the wax ball on my thumb. Start with the wax ball underneath of your thumbnail. Borrow the ring and slip it onto your ring finger of the same hand that has the wax ball under the pretense of saying, oh, it doesn't fit, or thank you very much, or some other byplay. Get it onto your ring finger. Transfer the wax ball from your thumbnail to your ring fingernail. Then remove the ring. I'm literally threading the ring right on the thread line. Now I'd want to reach over and pick up my beverage, take a drink, lean against the wall, or some way covertly anchor this piece of wax to something solid. My favorite is my coffee cup, just like we learned on the GTR instructional video. Well, now I've threaded the borrowed ring on the thread reel. This is now exactly the same routine as if I'm doing it with my own ring. It flies away, it flies toward me, back onto my finger. With a borrowed ring, I will most definitely break my thread. I'll pull from the wax ball, it'll break, and I can hand the ring right back out to the spectator again. It's only a couple of feet of thread, and the GTR is so simple to reset that I think it's worth it for this effect to be able to hand the ring right back out cleanly, unthreaded, right back to the spectator. That's Pull of Love with a Borrowed Ring. Thanks for watching. The Pull of Love, the borrowed finger ring that floats in the air, or your own finger ring that floats in the air, is from my book in 1992 called Floating Freely in a Fine Fashion. I think it's a very powerful effect for the Grand Illusions thread reel, close up for an audience. You've seen my video, now show me yours. I'd like to see what you're doing with a GTR. Upload to YouTube or email me. I'm Steve at GrandIllusions.com and watch the GrandIllusions.com slash GTR webpage for my works, your works, and soon to come instant downloads for the Grand Illusions Thread Reel. My name is Steve Johnson. Thanks for watching.